right, all right. We're recording. Hey, we got Kenny. Yes, sir. This one is something Prison, different, what's up? man. Hey, man. We're whipping this one for the channel. This one is going to be something special. <sighs> we have decided to display our full blown watch list, man. The ones that we spent hours researching and things like that and today we're going to be doing some technical analysis man just going through some of the things on the list we're gonna kick out some things that we don't we don't think we want to stick with and uh maybe we can see some good stuff in there too what do you think eddie sounds like a plan chief hey man let's do it we begin at the top here with the mvis by the yeah. way, I should give you some clicking abilities. Uh, this is micro vision, and uh, I think we looked at this one yesterday too. Yep. What we looked at it yesterday, and we didn't get into it. Hey, you know. Why? My strategy was just for one man because we looked at this. We also looked at VIPS which we did get into VIPS. I'm happy that we got into that one. Yep. Uh, we could have gone into this one, but it looks like a good recovery uh, play, right? If you look to the left. Oh, man. It's just kind of like in a squeeze right now. Let's expand it in that way. Yeah, that came out of nowhere. We saw it coming. Exactly. Uh, but we didn't expect this place to be this strong. So, now it's kind of moving back to the offside. I don't know. I think it's kind of a bit too late now. Obviously yeah, we'll be chasing. That, yeah, we'll chasing, be chasing. So we don't want to. We'll leave that one alone. GME, man. Yo, 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 yo. Before you leave MVIS, yeah. you can tell that it's also oversold with the RSI. Yeah, this is true. It's definitely yeah. uh, oversold with the RSI there. No, um, the. But the, the daily. The daily, yeah. the daily chart is still uh, showing exactly. that. Exactly there's still potential exactly the macd and ttm is saying there's still potential but mm. if you look historically it doesn't stay up well i cannot say that on the daily it but does it stay up for quite a while on the daily. stays up for a bit yeah but that that, that whole situation there doesn't exactly have a history of uh making strong moves like that so yeah yeah so question is what's making that move major this time around hmm Let's see. Maybe maybe if you look at the news. Is there any news maybe? Let's yeah. see what we have here. Well, there's something there. It says Michael Vision becomes new Wall Street Bets favorite. Oh, well, you know, that's it. That's well it. anything with Wall Street bets in it is. That's all you, know. you need to know. Hey, that's but, all you need uh, to know. Yeah, but that's from like three days. No, that's from three days ago. That's from fifteen hours ago. That's all you need, man. Three days. Look, look, look at your chart. It started Friday this on the twenty second. Actually, this might be some well Wall Street bets madness. Some yeah. Reddit madness. Yeah. Okay. Well, yeah. I'll tell us move along, man. Um, GameStop. I was thinking of getting to GameStop at one thirty. Hey. Because look at the charts of GameStop at the one thirty price. That was when the uh, MACD started recovering. Yeah, I can keep right? messing with GameStop, man. I'm I'm staying away from that. Uh, I'm staying away. I yeah. didn't get into it. I was thinking about it. Yeah. Um, just... <clears throat> I mean, for me, these days it's just all about looking at it and just seeing what madness is up to now. I don't even want to trade it. Um, but the the, 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 the the technical chart supports like if you just trade your technicals you can go in and out of this guy all day long. Out of GameStop? But, yeah. True, yeah. but um, you see all those resistance Yeah, it's little resistance. Bands right? there, man. Yeah. yeah. It's uh, I just feel like it's one of those things where it might be moving but it's so choppy that you know, if you take it down to a more granular level, like if you're looking at a one-minute chart or you know something lower, 
how is it really moving is it too choppy you know because it's on the soul of the daily but yeah so that's a, that's a 12 minute chart there yeah it looks really decent to be honest yeah it's sad I mean you could day trade it yeah you could day trade this dude absolutely I like it look at that move there uh, that's from uh, 158. Talks about 167. Yep. Solid play. Yep. I like that. And what do we have here? The two hour chart? Yes. Alright. Um, do you have any stocks that you're particularly interested in? AMC because I I could not exit my AMC 900% profit. Oh, dude, that's so stupid. True. Is it still in the so, profit right now without you being able to exit? Yeah, I am um, as of today 200% in the profit. 200%? Yeah. Well, yeah, I know you'll say take your profit. <laughs> well, I mean. <laughs> <laughs> I was gonna say that, but I know what is going on with that. So I know that there's no, there's no way to even get out of it for some reason. So, I actually have six uh, call options on it. I could sell a couple just to take my profit. I think I sold one already. You did? Yeah, I sold one out of the six. What was the strike price? Uh, ten bucks. Ten bucks. Yeah, it's currently level 67. Yay. Expiration? Uh, June 16th, I think. June 16th? Or June 6th. June 6th or June 16th. Oh, uh, then I think it's in June. You have time. That's pretty yeah, good. Yeah, that's right. Uh, I have May. Yeah. Absolutely. Well, this month though, according to our calendar, this is a good one to get out. <laughs> it's not a good one. It's not a good one. <laughs> hey man, you know, you might you might need to you might need to get out. Um yeah, I think, I think for me for me, um plus remember dude, anything that is not a leap man, it's always a good time to get out. True. Especially True. if you're winning. True. Um True. because we've seen how things can change direction suddenly and then uh, it's always that it's time that is not a, it's not to your advantage all this, all this is one crazy news yeah so, <laughs> exactly like kind of like, I had a, like when they threaten lockdowns yeah yeah so this is one that i'm excited about pltr oh baby is waking up <sighs> dude Finally. you know what Finally. i did today i actually sold some other things some other stocks that i had that were in the green okay i sold some of them and I put everything into PLTR, man. I am doubling down on PLTR. I am just going for the intensity, man. You know what I mean? I'm just gonna go heavy and go big. I think I'm way too heavy on PLTR. It's one of the biggest, fattest you think so? <laughs> in my portfolio. Hey, man. And yes, I'm just yeah, getting started, bro. I'm just getting started, man. I'm going to add more, too. I was in the hole, though, for buying too much. I'm hey. like 30, 35 or 36. Bro, average down, what man. Is that doing? Yeah, but when you, when you spent all the money, man, that's not well, nothing to average where the money is gone. True that. Well, just wait for it now, man. But just know yeah. that when, when it comes up, it's going to be up there, man. And, uh, yeah, I think that's 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 really <laughs> let's look at this on the chart too as we speak about it. Um, you know, PLTR is you know, it's I think it's it's definitely worth more than a forty-two dollar stock. You know what I mean? Um, anyway, it was on its way up, right, to its all-time highs and trying to reach its greatest potential, trying to be its best PLTR when. You know, media just started life happened, man. The media struck it down, so it's fallen from about forty. What is it? Forty-five. Like down. I am literally fifty-three percent down. Fifty-three percent down on that. And exactly. Forty-three percent down in another portfolio. Exactly. So 
I've just been loading every time and because I started buying into it when it was like around twenty five dollars and then I averaged down further into twenty four. I think I'm still hanging around twenty four dollars right now. But I've just been continuously averaging down. Maybe at some point I might say at twenty three, but right now things are looking good and I just wanna keep adding dude. Yeah, I think the, the charts that you show here also support that. The RSI. Right. It's not really overbought yet. Right. Actually, it looks like it's you know it's looking to an old. It's crossing over. Exactly. Uh, TTM squeeze is still kind of flat, but let's, let's get that squeeze out. Exactly. So. Uh, I think. On the daily and the and the two hours, so that's really good. And then looking at it on trading view as well, oh. uh, kind of also gives that good confidence. Absolutely. Let's see here. We have PLTI. Yeah, look at the. Uh, Looking at the daily chart there, man. Uh, look at that Fibonacci. So it's not. 26 would be a strong resistance. So it's not facing any major resistance right now. So right. once it crosses that 0.382, that's some serious confidence for it to keep moving. Exactly. So, um, the other. The other, those other resistance are not. 0.618, uh, it will cross that. And that's like twenty four dollars and twenty cents. So we're good. We're good. Twenty six hours is the major next. It's the next major lower resistance. I yeah, think. I think yeah. it's gonna move right through it. You know, um, unless somebody decides to screw it up for us again. You know how that. True happens. that. True that. I mean, but there's all this talk of like, um, you know, uh, just the institutional money being rotated back into the growth stocks and things like that. The EVs. Yeah. So yeah. we'll see how it goes, man. <clears throat> but I'm in it. Yeah. I'm waiting for it. Uh, NIO actually also started crossing over, uh, oh. and I think I think I'm actually going to ditch my NIO once do it, do it. I get to a certain percentage of profit. I'm gonna ditch it and I'm gonna put it onto PLTR. Don't do it. I have 100 percent profit on NIO because I've got it at what six bucks. I know. That and I'm not. Hang on to it. Hang on to it. This is going to be my Tesla, man. This is my Tesla ride. But the problem <laughs> I have is that I should have bought a lot more because I only have about 160 shares. I should of, have bought like 500 shares. I of, a, of a NIO? Yeah. yeah. Ooh. I yeah. buy them all. I need to get more. I do, I, I, do, I, I do have some color options on it too, so I should get a good price. Absolutely. Yeah, I need, to get a, I need to get more and more. And uh, that... Well, no. PLTR is where I'm, I'm going. So we'll see though. For right now, I'm still holding the NEO shares. Also, there's the, RMSL. I don't know if you've seen the, this uh, thing. The chats on NEO is strong, too, by the way. Just real quick before we carry on there. You remember RMSL, REM slip? Yeah, this penny stock yeah. that I still cannot buy for some reason. <laughs> Dude, I wish I bought more than 7,000 shares, man. Because I bought, I bought 10,000 shares for my brother. And this thing was like somewhere down there when I got into it. And uh, yeah, I'm just basking in gains right now with this thing. I'm not even in a rush to get out. We'll see what happens. That's the one that Uncle talked about, right? Um, no, actually, this one was from you, dude. Oh, yeah, 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 this yeah. This one is from you. You gave me this, and I don't know. Kenny gives me stocks, and then he doesn't get into them. <laughs> and I... <laughs> Wait, hey, hey. I tried to get it on Wibble. I tried to get it everywhere else, but I could not get it for some reason, so hey, I could not man. buy it. I went over I'll to the old guys at I went over to the old guys at Fidelity, bro, and uh, oh, they Fidelity, were like, I love you to buy it. yeah, man, they were like, call me, in, sir, you know what I mean? We'll give you the phone. You can call your broker on the phone. <laughs> and, <laughs> and, <laughs> and, 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 I was like, yes, sir. I would like three shares. No, make that seven thousand shares of RM <laughs> of RMSL. And they were like, all right, dude. You can hear his pencil like scribbling it for me, but. Nah, um, I think this is one that it was interesting. I got into it, and we'll see, man. It might go to a dollar one day. Um, I'm in no rush to get rid of it. We'll see what happens. Kenny, it's not too late, man. You can I know, I know it's not too late. I yeah. just, I, I just wrote it down on my list of things yeah, to look man. at. You can chase it, man. It's just gonna be a light jog. Not much of a run. Oh no! Look at the charts, man. I'm not gonna wait. I'm not gonna get it now. On our. Uh, let me put RMSL inside the uh, transpire and see what it looks like. I'm gonna work for that downturn and get it at the cheaper price. 
Yeah, right now it looks like he wants to keep going up. Um, I don't, I don't know how much of a downturn you're expecting, down, it's so, have. but for those of us who are already in it, we don't want to come back down. <laughs> 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 oh, dude, I think I can get it. Oh, jeez, yeah, hey. on the daily and the two hour, this baby is moving. Suck a little bit. Hey man, hop in, man, hop in, man. Let's go, hop in. Okay. So, well, let's switch gears a bit here, man. Cryptocurrency, man. Yeah, go to the crypto. What What do you have? What do you have? Okay, here's something that I let me point this out before we get started here. I made a video. The last video I made, I said that crypto uh, Bitcoin was probably going to come down to about fifty six. Dude, my analysis in that video came pretty close to what I described okay I had put this line here and I said that Bitcoin was gonna probably going to fall down to about the 56 uh, K level there okay it did not hit 56 you, but if you, you see that for, you, you made 46 uh, sorry 46 46 yeah, yeah. At, at the time when I was saying it there the thing was probably hanging around like uh, 49 50 something like that yeah. and it moved down to this point and it did not hit it now here's the strange thing it's pulling back up there as you see but i really think that it's going to still come back down to that uh 46 uh because of the uh before we move on it's trending downwards again yeah i think it that might not, it, it, it might not end that low it never goes past that i hope it, it does not... because that's where i want to buy some <laughs> one by one <laughs> yeah that's what but the technical analysis is not showing that it's gonna get there though um Put that on uh put, put that put that on uh, on uh, trend spider real quick. Trend spider. Let's see. Yeah, yeah, let's take a look at it then. Trend spider. And pull up the uh, uh the Bitcoin yeah, the uh, crypto list. Crypto list. Let's do this. Look at that chart, man. That baby is not coming back. So so mm. called forty six. Mm, mm, mm. Yes, 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 yes. Uh, I see what uh, you're saying. I don't think it's gonna be coming. <laughs> not coming back down for you, baby. Oh, I should have got it. Uh, dude, look at those breakout signals, man. Okay, well. I was telling you this weekend when we were doing that research that we should get this. It was a 49, then it was a 48, 46. We didn't get it. We were busy buying some other stuff. I mean, Let's you look know, at the other stuff we bought this weekend to see how well they did. With where it is right now, I'm totally cool, you know what I mean? It is fine, right? Um, we'll get another you want to take a look at some of the stuff that you bought this weekend, right? Sure. So, we did chilies, right? Yeah. So, this weekend we gathered, we did some chilies. Chilies, let's see, when was that? Saturday, Saturday. Sunday. So, you haven't made any gains yet. Because, oh. let's see. So, there's the 26, right? Yeah, today's 26. So Saturday was the 24th there. Well, you haven't really made much gains, but you know, just a bit too shaky. But if you look at the thing, it's sitting there at that uh, support level, mm -hmm. and hopefully it will make that run again at least to um, uh, 80 cents. question is are you going to collect profit there or are you going to let it keep going long time investor long term long investor look at that I'm not like your boy uh, the VA <laughs> buying new and selling it <laughs> talking about life happens hey, life man. never happens you're old your diamond ends hey man sometimes man we're just going for, we're just nibbling the profits man we're like rabbits <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Um that is engine. Uh looks pretty good. This one is an NFT coin. Um as you can see I put a uh an alert there and yeah, said it says yeah. take profit. So we'll see what happens. I might change my mind when the time comes. Alright. Uh something else you have. Um, oh, Z, um, ZIL. 
Ah, Zelika. Yes. Zelika. Z I L. Yeah, that looks decent. Absolutely. Looks like it should be moving up soon. Photo like, what the hell is ZIL? Never heard of that before. <laughs> hey, <coughs> well, you bought it. <laughs> you gotta get into those ones that nobody knows nothing about yet. Hey, it's something like, uh, it's, it's, I think it's the ZIL, ZIL is related to an NFT sort of deal, isn't it? It's the, uh, what's the, the finance related um, stuff. Exactly. Uh, uh, Wi-Fi, what is it called? Yeah, I know yeah, you guys are doing some research on that one. I wasn't looking. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah, yeah. It, has, it has to do with um, trading, trading, uh, uh, trading coin. Okay. Well, we'll keep an eye on it and see how it's going. I think that the one that I'm really worried about right now is ICX, Icon. Icon. <sighs> I was expecting this to have run today. This yeah, was this week to was supposed to be weekend. the uh, yeah, yeah. This week was and, supposed to be um, the big day. Yes, it has not happened yet, which has me wondering what is going on, and I'm a bit nervous about it. I'm wondering if I should start considering getting out, but and we'll wait. The long run. Why we'll wait. I was trying to kick out, bro. Because okay, I got into this thing. My plan getting into this thing was a short-term play. Okay, it was under some serious hype at the time, and so I decided to jump into it. And the time frame that I gave myself to be in ICX is coming to an end, man. This it's not was like an, you put your entire portfolio in there to make I did not put my it. entire portfolio in it, but it's it's in. I had to I, I used Bitcoin funds for it. Oh, so you wanted to make so quick and then get back into BTC? Yeah, you know what I mean? It was supposed to do like a quick flip. I was, <sighs> I was trying to, I was, just, I was not trying to time anything, but Bitcoin was on the move down at the time. And I was like, okay, yeah, and I know that ICX coins, will be huh? moving up. Yes, I was like, I can Don't make the earnings on ICX, exactly, then get back into Bitcoin. And this train is running extremely late right now, is what is happening. So, yeah, why yeah. is this leaving you behind? <laughs> It's all good. Look, uh, I'm just gonna get some more BTC some other way, and uh, yep. whenever grass this comes, always, in. grass is not always greener on the other side, bro. Hey man, you know <laughs> I'm learning the hard way, bro. <laughs> I'm wow. learning the hard way, man. So, oh, yeah. So yeah, that's just where we are at right now. But okay. other than that, um, that is it, man. Uh, do you have any other plays you want to share with the people today? Uh, I would say this is good for today. Let's keep it short so that yes, we can man. come back and show some more justice tomorrow. Wait, you know what? Let's make a peak for tomorrow. What is a peak? What's gonna What's gonna blow up tomorrow? Based on our Based on our list. Oh, what are we predicting to blow up tomorrow? Yeah, yeah. What's gonna blow up? tomorrow? Mm. Let's 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 make a prediction. A prediction, a prediction. Well, yeah. you go for it first, did, man. We, uh, are you going? Okay, okay, is it crypto or conventional stock? Uh, I cannot pick crypto because I don't know what goes on in that world. I'm just looking okay. at technical analysis for that. But for the stocks, I know that we've done the fundamental research in a lot of the companies on our list. Yeah. The ones on Transpider, okay. and we just need to do the technical to figure out when to get in. Uh, I've been is... watching, I have been watching Playboy man from eight dollars, right? And I'm kind of mad at myself for not getting into that. <laughs> <sighs> I didn't, I didn't really have a any interest what? in it at the time, but I'm realizing that I should have gotten into that one as well. But yeah, you know, uh, what but is I, gonna break out tomorrow? What is? I have, uh, tomorrow? I have two tell and sense. Um, call options that just expired out of the money right and they're just finally picking up but i still don't think i will pick sense i don't think i will pick. okay i think afria is breaking out tomorrow <laughs> uh, yeah. A -P -P -H. let's see 
Dude, as soon as I said that, all of the resistance showed up, man. Um, yeah, but then, no, no, wait a second. It's getting out of resistance right now. On the two hours. Okay, I'm sticking with that one then. I think Afria is gonna yeah. break up tomorrow. Yeah, that looks good. That looks good. That looks good. That looks really good. Right. Yeah. So this is the this is the green company in Pennsylvania that I told you that doing the. I'm calling it. It might not stuff. look, man. It might not make it past sixteen. It might not make it past sixteen, but I think that it's going to break away from that fourteen seventy six where it's at right now. That's what, what is I'm that saying. It's at seventeen dollars right now. Oh, up here. I'm looking at APPH. I'm looking at no. Uh, I'm looking I'm at harvest. APHA is what we're looking at. Oh, APHA. Yeah. That looks good too. Look at APPH as well. Well, you asked me for what I think is gonna break out, man. Yeah, you pick that. I pick the other one. Oh, you pick APPH? Yes, sir. You think it's gonna break out? I let me look at my let me let me look at it on with that red you. signal there. <laughs> okay. Wait, 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 wait. wait. Hey, my, we can, we can go here, man. my chart is not showing it though. Oh, let's see. I did see. I just I just saw I just saw a signal that it's gonna go down. Uh, wait, what was the signal I gave you? Uh, the uh, what was the ticker I gave you? It's now APHA up here. A P H K. Yes, sir. Uh, yeah, yeah. Yeah. So that's mine. Okay. Let me, right let, here. let me not rush. Let me let me take some pictures and figure out what's going on here. Um. Yeah, that's not a hammer. That's not a major signal here. Um. It's trending downward though. The RSI is saying it's overbought. Okay, give me, give me, give me two seconds to look for another one, <laughs> just in case. Uh, this must be how. Uh, what is the guy from Mad Money, man? Jeez, why can I never remember that guy? The Kramer. This must be how Kramer does his research, man. Like, give me two seconds. Give me two seconds. <laughs> give me two seconds. What is CRM? BNGO looks good. BNGO, right you said? Yeah, BNGO is back. By Nano Genomics. Uh, I know, I know. We used to make money back on that back in the day. Yeah, it used to be a good one. It used to be a good one. I think okay. BNGO is and you back. think this is about to break out? I think, I don't know, not major, major breakout, but I think it's going to move up tomorrow. Tomorrow? And, yeah, and, um, yeah, my picks are BNGO and FTFC. Okay. Well, mine is just that one. Afria. Yeah. I think Afria is going to make it. All right. Well, uh, it was a cool video. On to the next one, man. Great technical analysis. I'm excited, man. Uh, I was supposed to make money in crypto this season. But at the same time, we could also get slapped around. Who knows? We don't control the market, you know. Brazen Just out. Yet, so. <laughs> <laughs> exactly. <laughs> Double there we out. go. Skirt, skirt.